Hi friends, welcome back to the Guitar Spa where we bring you all the beautiful guitars reviewed just for you and uh, this year is 2014 and 2014 I'm gonna do one review and this is a Yamaha and this is uh, not your, this is a LS uh, LS16 a small body, very much like a grand concert but I've done the LS6 and LS16 before but this is a new model, new 2014 uh, LS16 which is different from the previous model and uh, let's get started basically a uh, same you get the same uh, Shape model, but a couple of differences that are, are available number one you you have the Angleman top screws solid Angleman top screws and back and sides are the uh, Indian rosewood that are solid with uh, something like a maple uh, binding all over this uh, the pig guard normally is uh, the previous uh, LS16 was uh, a black pig guard. This one has like a torsion shell with a uh, pig guard. And uh, Abalone, uh, uh, what I call the uh, Abalone um, Rosette. This one comes with the Indian Rosewood uh, fretboard and uh, Indian Rosewood uh, look like ebony, but uh, ebony fretboard that is bound. Indian Rosewood head plate with the die cast units. Uh, I'll suggest if you can to pay a little bit more and upgrade it to the uh, what you call the Gutor tuners uh, that is a six uh, at the six o'clock where the, the screw buttons are uh, that will give you a little bit more precision uh, tuning uh, this what are the difference uh, the difference is in the neck the previous neck was a, a three ply neck this one comes with a five uh, laminated five uh, ply uh, neck pr profile and the profile is slightly beefier uh, uh, slightly rounder and beefier on, on this guitar a one three quarter neck or, or they call it 44 centimeter uh, millimeters we slightly low just just slightly short of a one three quarter very much uh, you get a plastic saddle and a plastic uh, nut and the plastic pins. I've upgraded the uh, bone uh, to the bone, uh, where they get bone pins, die bone pins, and also the saddle. Upgraded the saddle. I was also what I've done was to because the pins, uh, bridge pins, are not slotted. So once you lower down the uh, what I call that action on the saddle, the break angle, you know, if it's like that, and then break angle goes this way. Why I do it? I slotted it, and it gives you a forty-five degrees to. To give you more a downward pressure, mm -hmm. downward pressure of the saddle, and allows the the more resonant in terms of the the bridge, so that you actually use less uh, right hand tending on this guitar. Um, bracing pattern is a little bit different. Firstly, uh, one thing it, it, uh, this this guitar is different is it, it has the A R O E. What is the A R E that is built in on this guitar? The top is actually an acoustic resonant enhancement uh, system they, they did on the wood itself so let me just read the it's actually on uh, they took the original wood let me just read it from here um, original wood technology by Yamaha where they, they, they control the temperature the humidity and the a atmospheric pressure so that the molecules they change the molecules of the wood or maybe what we say they crystallize the the, the, the resins that are on the wood faster um, manipulating it so uh, that gives you they did a, a what you call a demonstration on it where the wood becomes a little bit more resonant um, I would say this is only to me personally this is my opinion and everybody is entitled to my opinion is that uh, this is one of the the ways uh, one of the key factors but it's not one of the factors the other factor that is make a difference is the bracing pattern that because I had another LS series that was here then I, I took my mirror and watched the bracing this one has a forward shift X brace uh, but it's a modified non scallop what do I mean by modified non scallop the previous uh, uh, what I call that the uh, cross sectionally the, the the braces are almost like triangular this one is just rectangular cut and the braces are slightly thicker so when you have a thicker braces the travels uh, if you have thicker and shorter generally the travels are a little bit eccentric of travels um, but probably they also what they did was also uh, thin down the the the, the sides the, the parameters of the the top. Um, the the braces are non scalloped but about two about here they scoop 
the end part so it gives you that this this whole top acts like a drum even the the uh, the side braces so instead of cutting the what white call that the the ends just maybe one and a half inches is slightly maybe two and a half to three inches um, where they scoop the, the the end of the braces so you get straight braces thick straight short and then they scoop it up on the edges so it gives you a little bit more um, what we call that higher travels clearer travels so they accentuate more travels but also what they did with the scoop on the the ends of the braces also loosen up the top a little bit that's what that's that's my my after i analyze it my analysis of of how this guitar sounds because when i first took it it was a new piece i took one strum the owner said i took one strum i said wow my goodness this is a lively sounding guitar so lively sounding guitar as the guitar age you don't have to worry because the bass response will open up over time um the top underneath is slightly uh they really sand it down a little but i can see quite a, a, a little bit of excess glue white glue uh transparent glue that is uh, uh oozing out from the braces that's something that uh, maybe um yamaha can take note of it this guitar is made in china of course under strict qc quality control from yamaha so uh, what does this guitar does is it's clear it's responsive is really great for 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 finger picking as well as medium moderate strumming you can also wear this maybe because non scallop it, uh, but I, I i personally like this piece uh, over the previous uh, generation of the ls16 so let's just test run it uh this is strung with elixir 1253 possible bronze and i tone write it <laughs>
I will say the bass is slight balanced, so not very over overpowering. Fairly responsive, fairly responsive guitar. Uh, let's uh, come closer and just listen to how this guitar would sound um, acoustically near. Let me just play it on a third fret and, uh, well, just don't focus on me, focus on the guitar. It's all about the guitar and nothing about me. Let's look at those bone pits. If you can see those bone pins, uh, it's dyed, beautiful. The trebles are sweet, man.
things do that. So I, I particularly like this piece. The troubles are clear uh, for a guitar like this, uh, even though it's made in China. The troubles are really clear and uh, for a new guitar, I'm pretty impressed. Of course, uh, with all the enhancement work uh, done on this guitar, that's why it, it, it sounds more than what it, you, you would pay for a guitar like this. So if you were to get this guitar, do some maybe change the saddle, get the pins removed, the plastic pins, if, and also if you can afford it is to change the nut also if you can afford, because the nut costs a little bit more. But uh, this is basically what you can do for your guitar, and also slot the pinholes, slot the pinholes, okay. Something to note about this uh, new model of uh, LS16. Uh, LS16, it comes with the uh, the the pickup that is uh, they call it a Yamaha Zero Impact pickup that is actually uh, fitted in here. You can see there's three screws here, uh, three two screws, two screws on this pickup. Uh, it's actually an under saddle piezo pickup. Uh, that is uh, what I call that passive. So it's a decent pickup. You just want a pickup that uh, comes out with uh, some amplification. There's no battery in it. This one is uh, mm -hmm. a passive. There's no battery, just an under saddle. Um, however, if you want something a little bit more better, which with such a sounding guitar, because uh, uh, being a under saddle, it doesn't really replicate the the exact tone of the guitar. It does. It does give you an, an a nice okay distance amplified tone but if you really want something better i would strongly suggest to put the lr Bax lyric system on this because the 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 acoustic tone is really superb the acoustic tone is really rich and clear and it it, it will it, it this does 
just if you really put a microphone system like the lyric system on this and I'm sure that it will shine uh, especially in a live setting whether you're playing fingerstyle or whether you're playing in a band setting because this is a small body so chances of uh, having feedback issues is really uh, close to minimum Okay, if you're in Singapore, this was actually bought from, uh, you can actually buy, buy it from Luther Music. This, this exact piece was bought through Luther Music. The pricing is about the same as the old RLS 16 series, but this one has to pick up in, uh, which I leave to you. If you want to upgrade, just remove it. Or you can get it from uh, the Plaza Singapore Yamaha, you know, Plaza Sing Singapore, where they sell the Yamaha guitars. These are the two places. But I would prefer you to go to Luther Music because Luther, the Luther guys are really nice people at Peninsula Plaza, Excelsior Hotel, upstairs, level 2. So if you like this review of the LS16, just post a comment just below this YouTube video. And if you want to watch more great guitar reviews, is, is to subscribe to this channel. So uh, this just to recap, Anger Moon Spruce Top on this, the non scallop uh, bracing that is forward shifted, non scallop but they scoop up the, the ends here about three, three uh, inches so to free up and the braces are thick as well as short and rectangularly cut, not uh, what you call it, um, uh, what you call it, tapered as with the previous ones and uh, there's no what they call cloth that normally they put on the middle of the x rays um in the rules with back and sides uh, lovely five piece neck uh, the neck set is, is this guitar is perfect i don't see any flaw in this this guitar even though it's made in china it's like more expensive than most china guitars but the quality of the finish is there you got a a, a, a nice lovely case built in um tuners uh, probably needs to be upgraded so if you can afford it and, and um, that's probably uh, this are some things of this uh, and the ARE technology the acoustic resonance enhancement that they made on the top of the guitar uh, so if uh, I'm gonna sign up soon my name is Jarvis and I love with passion play guitar allow love joy peace health and wealth to be multiplied in your life I'll see you very soon bye bye